Okay, I'll just show you how to uh, delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this Nissan Navara. Now, from any screen, if we just go to settings, you'll see there you've come up with navigation, audio, phone, Bluetooth. There's no phone connected at the moment, so phone's greyed out. So if we just turn the control here down till we'll get to Bluetooth and then click enter, you've got Bluetooth paired, Bluetooth devices and paired device list. So we turn down to paired device list and click enter in the center. And again, you see hands-free there. We click on hands-free and Barry's iPhone. So I click on Barry's iPhone, then it gives me the choice of connect, preferences or delete. So I turn down to delete, click delete, yes. Okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this uh, Nissan Navara. So from any screen, first of all, we make sure Bluetooth is switched on like so, and then we're watching out at the bottom. This car has two Bluetooth audio systems, so no doubt parrots, yeah, parrots come up there. That's not the one we want. So over to the audio system, we click settings, we turn down to Bluetooth, click Bluetooth, and you've got pair Bluetooth devices, click pair. Is the Bluetooth device you are trying to pair a mobile phone? Yes, it is. So we're now, we've now got my car come up. We click my car. There you go, using your handset, look for Bluetooth. The pin's one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four. Click pair. Allow contacts and favorites to sync. Allow. Let's see, and it's connected. Now, another good thing with this system, sometimes it, it's a bit tricky, uh, especially if you've just deleted your phone and repaired it like I've done. So I'll, I'll just go through it. We'd, go to music onto music i'll turn this down i don't want it playing through the speakers so hopefully that's turned right down we'll click play and onto the music the silver triangle with the three silver circles at the bottom if you click on that you'll see it's only showing iphone it's not not giving me another option so over here you've got auxiliary if i click on auxiliary Again, it's Bluetooth audio has not been selected. Right, so back to settings. If we go to audio, you'll see nothing there except controls on what to use. So we go to settings, down to Bluetooth, click on Bluetooth, pair Bluetooth device, pair device list, onto paired device list, hands-free, and then audio. So we click on audio, sorry, I'll just get that back. Click on audio, you've got Barry's iPhone. Click enter. Device name, select. Switch into audio, Barry's phone. Now, you'll see there, still nothing's happened. But, if I turn off the ignition, lock the door, open the door start the car again with a bit of luck when it comes back on and we click auxiliary Barry's iPhone connected and my car comes up there so if you're struggling getting the audio through just do that that's how you do it okay I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this 2013 Nissan Navara. So from any screen, you've got map there if you just want to look where you're going or get an idea where you're going. There you go, and you can you can turn the, the map up like so, zoom in just using that wheel. But if you want to uh, plan a, a route, if you click on destination, you've got new address. Click new address, and there you've got country, postcode, city. We want postcode, that's quicker. Postcode. So we're Grumner Garage, Chorley Road, Wantleydale, Preston, P, R, and then to move quickly between rows, you can use the direction arrows, five. Now, because we've only got two letters, sorry, two numbers in our postcode, we'll go down to space, click space, and then up to four, P, R, five, four, J, S for sugar, 
We've got list down here. Click on list, and that's giving it you Chorley Road, Wantley Dale, and we click OK. New menus come up now. Now it's worked out the route, and we click start. That's it.